Okay, good afternoon, guys. Our topic is about bomb and beam bearing. No, the peaks require the first bearing to be uh, less than 45 degrees from the bow. Uh, and we, example, we are having a course line of 090 degrees, and our speed is 10 knots. Ang ating speed 10 knots, no. Now, we will take the first bearing from the Charlie Tower, no? With a bearing of 60 degrees. 60 degrees. So, a bearing ng 60, we convert that in into true from 90 less 60 equal to 30 degrees angle from our course line, no? That is the Charlie around 0900 now that we transfer the first bearing is 30 degrees from our uh, position no on our course line then we travel after uh, 15 minutes no we sighted a another bearing from the charlie tower which is a double no we will double the angle so again 60 degrees and we sighted again uh, 90 degrees and our uh, bearing from our position will be transferred again the second bearing and then you will have uh, 60 no 60 bearing so as uh, 10 knots no we have speed of 10 knots and we have to get the distance so distance equal to speed multiplied by time over 60 so speed is uh, 10 knots and time is 15 minutes divided 60 we will have a a value or 2.5 no, nautical miles so the distance from point of 0900 up to 915 is 2.5 so as we say that the distance uh, travel from point A to C is 2.5 is equal to the distance of a point from the object when we are in a beam position. So the distance of 0, 0.915 traveled from 0, 0.900 0, 0 is equal to the distance from Bravo to Alpha and to Bravo and Charlie to Alpha.